The conference has been sponsored by Jazz, Paladin, and uh, Eva Nova. We decided to attend the conference this year because um, of the information sessions. We, I found that there is some information that I'm not getting from her doctors and I don't feel um, prepared to help her through her diagnosis um, and dealing with epilepsy, so I'm looking to get a lot of information. Okay. <laughs> this conference is important to meet uh, families that are going through similar situations. Uh, we've only been here uh, a couple hours and we met some really nice families who have gone through similar situations so it's uh, nice to bounce ideas and uh, just different uh, different things off of each other someone that uh, understands you yeah. um, our daughter going to camp it was the first time she had ever really played with or met other kids with epilepsy so like she gets the opportunity to be with people like her and we get to meet families like ours What are you going to do today? Climb, climb the ladder. It looks pretty tall. You think you're going to be able to do it? Yes. You've done this before though, right? Yes. You're a pro. Yes. Why are you a pro? Tell everyone why you're a pro. Because I'm good at climbing this. You have no fear. It was important for us to attend this conference today um, because we have been wanting to meet more people in the epilepsy community. It's been two years since Piper's diagnosis and so far we've met a lot of wonderful um, people. We've learned a lot of things from other families. So we we're hoping to grow our epilepsy family by, by coming today. My daughter said it to me, Mommy, you don't need to go because you know everything there is to know. <laughs> no, honey, I don't. I will never know because every time I learn something new. So, um, Epilepsy Cell Central Ontario teaches me something new every single time. And every time I meet somebody new, it's learning something and furthering myself better for my daughter. We decided to come because there's actually not a whole lot uh, surrounding epilepsy around us. And like to have a whole weekend uh, just learning and supporting each other was just like, how could I not do that? This is really important. It just helps us connect and understand a little bit more of epilepsy and the symptoms and management skills. Like for today, for example, today we learned about management skills, mental like mental health would be next, and Different then types of treatments. Yeah, and, uh, I guess like the future, I guess treatments. Of yeah. Which is a term that we're trying not to use because of stigma. Um, I just spoke at the conference here uh, about epilepsy and transition for uh, this great event that has been organized for, by Epilepsy South Central Ontario. And I've, got, I've gotten great feedback from families and patients. And I believe what we're doing here and what this organization brings for patients and families is a lot of knowledge and empowering them to actually search for better treatments, better, um, better care in general. It's a good opportunity for everybody to be sharing uh, their experiences. Uh, the one-on-one -on -one experiences are probably the best uh, when people um, provide information on what their journey was. So. Well, folks, this is the Family and Youth Conference 2023. 
want to thank all the families, all the kids, everybody for coming down. Hope to see you next year for 2024. Woo! Cheers. <laughs>